uh, Spotify is disconnected. There we go. Welcome, welcome. Good evening, good evening. Taking a little quick look at my land here, actually. Okay, so that's super armor with a knockdown. Fuhrer is forward guard. And there's a flow. Also down smash. So these are down smashes near the end. Forward guard and actually also forward. Okay. <coughs> a flow vice also is a down smash. Huh? <coughs> okay. This is just a him. Healing blades, bleeding hearts. Okay, phantom. Go core deadly dance makes the super armor. This is just freaking big CC, as far as I remember back in the day. Okay. Um, looks like not super many pre awakened skills actually. So what happens if I go? What happens if we go prime? What skills become good? So this is just army. This becomes an um, stiffness with super armor. Alright, let's see. Absolute fear is this forward army. Stiffness with forward guard. Becomes stiffness, striding slash, and a forward guard. The bond on attack too. So free floating. Same. This one is forward guard. And now it becomes forward guard. <coughs> and a super armor during it because it's just a lot bigger. Hmm. Bloating. Ah, get super armor during attack 2 3. Bloomin. Also get super armor. Oh my god, lasts forever. Okay. Oh, a lot of skill points on this, holy crap. And looks like <laughs> I can kind of read my combo from the movement here. But she does not have anything equipped. And it looks like I did take away her breath, strength, and health level and gave it to someone else. <clears throat> so there is that little sad problem, I suppose. If I would replay Lon. But that's those are things we can overcome, though. I mean, literally, a lot of these things are actually still good. Um, with the difference of my movement skills, they're supposed to be more in the middle now. Let's see... So 9, 10... I mean, I would do that once I actually start playing it again. These are some of the big skills indeed. Alright, so that has potential. I don't have a outfit anymore, but it's fine. <clears throat> and it's it's kind of fine. I mean, I, we can get that easy peasy. And I would probably get the normal one that I always get on her. Sanguine Petal. This thing just looks amazing. This, this outfit just looks amazing. It's the first one that got on her at least. I mean, I don't probably don't even think I'll I'll get this one on her. I mean, it still looks hella sexy, but the sanguine petal already does as well. Okay, but I was gonna take a look at a guardian, and I don't have a guardian. I just saw. I just noticed. <clears throat> so let me make one real quick. As a trial. The am room as well anyway. So I'll have to remove something or get an extra slot. Which is a little problem, I think. It's also the lead you. Yes. Create a new one. Yes. And Guardian's gonna be giga slow though. But I don't wanna have a look at the skills. Guardian testy. Check. Testy with two eyes. Check. Um. Um.
Punch, punch. Oh, that's what that does. Okay. The grab has minus DP, that's insane. Can freaking walk like this, that's insane. Okay, let's have a quick look first, because I have no clue what does what on her <clears throat> at all. But there's obviously the grab. E buff would give all AP, crit hit rate, accuracy, move speed, critical hit damage. Super armor for the first 10 seconds or what? For reals? Just super armor instantly for a while. Okay. Cross slide. Backwards the line. It's the iframe that we have, I think. I don't see the movement speed going on though. Movement speed plus 10 for... Oh wait, yeah, because this one's already up. Okay, there we go. Makes sense. Glorious. Backwards LMB is a knockback on... It's... Bomb. Backwards RMB is a float. And we have Shift F, Super Armor, Float, and a Down Smash. Shift RMB, which is a Super Armor, into RMB afterwards for a Super Armor and a Bound. God Incarnation is Shift Q, Recover HP, LVP, Minus, Super Armor, and... No. Oh, come on. Give me a minute. Okay. Blow the ashes after cleansing flame. What's cleansing flame? Oh, shift F. Okay. Dragon's Maw. Shift LMB forward guard. Mm, if we hold, we just do extra damage. Okay. 
infernal steps. Hold on, me to continue this game. Okay. Oh, that's the uh, forward rush. This one is so funny as I hacked over there, right? Scaling torn EF. Alright. Infernal Nemesis, backwards F. Invincible while moving, super armor on attacks. Alright, okay. Fireborn space during some skill skill using gun. Forward RMB is super armor invincible while concealed. Oh. Seems pretty slow indeed though. Take a look at that. <laughs> super armor here. Super armor on grapple. Oh, that's her uh, her grab, I guess. Rock slide, shift space. Guard. Oh, she goes back in guard. Oh, okay, no. The mm -hmm. gate crasher backwards huh? Mutilation shift RMB. Right. RMB after stuff and RMB floating attacks. Oh, forgot to learn it off of Super armor, shift F. Shift Q. I think in general you stay most of the time in... Uh, Awaken though. But what can we get? Okay, so, let's see. G glorious advance. Backwards LMB. Knockback on attacks. Alright. Gets forward guard. I don't think that's super good. Core God Incinerator. In, in, in incinerator. <laughs> Bound on hits. This thing is super armored on. Or Searing Flame. Uh, Searing Fang. Also becomes a bound. See shift or MB. There's already a bound on the floor though. Ooh, the second attack is unprotected of that. Okay. Or cleansing flame. It's a floating on hits. That is super armor. Shift F. Okay. Scornful slash gets forward guard. This one. Backwards RMB and has floating on hits. I mean, honestly, if you can have like a super armor float, I think that's still better. Or Dragon's Maul. Knock down on hits. Dragon's Maul. But it's just forward guard. And super armor afterwards. Honestly, I don't know what the most common core skill taken is here. Hmm. <coughs>
Neck impaler, uh -huh. Okay, there we see. Cleansing flame, that's what I expected, right? A floating on the super armor. Yeah, that's what I expected, honestly. So we have a floating on the uh, shift F skill here. Well, it looks fancier when it's upgraded. It's pretty slow though. If you look at this. <laughs> that one is just super funny though. Um. Looks like if we use that after, after it's and it goes a little faster. <laughs> What's the searing fang? It's shift RMB. It's not continuously protected though, that's kind of weird. Oh, but I don't know. Dragon's more shift LMB. Bridget Wing. Oh yeah, that's the... That one. Choose though. I need to choose though. I don't have weapons on the lance, so it's not like I can actually try her out. Unless I give her some really uh, cheap stuff, I guess. You should probably look at the add ons though first. Um, um, um. I give her just easy peasy weapons and I have something at least. All right. Skill being our engage also. It's bleeding. I think getting human damage on that and all DP minus is probably not too bad to be fair. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
Let's see. War is tragic. I would definitely from time to time. It's a comedy. It's something attack speed wise on Deadly Dome. And then probably <clears throat> <clears throat> Minus DP, I think, honestly. Or plus human damage, maybe. Yeah. Let's see what else we have here. Param pam param pam param. Do we actually Let's see? Is there a skill that I will use somewhere that has like already minus DP on it? Like not. Mm -hmm. Alright, looks like we don't have an actual minus DP skill. Oh here. Currently pain. That's so nasty bad to use. Okay. Bleeding hearts. Bleeding hearts has. Okay, okay. Some bleeding hearts. Do you want to be part of a bigger world? Then travel. There's no reason Bleeding to hearts, or we want to add even more minus DP then. And maybe crit hits, right? Sure. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Let's see, Tailspin is one of our big skills as well. Shift or MP with the flow of ice as well. That's a down smash actually. Bam, 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 bam. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Let's see. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this all evasion rate down so we put more all evasion rate down might help it's usually near the end of the combo on either as well already has a hundred crit rate <laughs> Hmm, just thinking here, just thinking here. Bam, 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 bam. Since it has critical... It's up. Let's go with critical then. For now. Maybe down attack. Oosh. And let's go with flow vice, maybe. I don't see this all the time, no? Flow mangler. When do you use flow mangler again? <clears throat> Super armor and a knockdown. Mm, where, where is that? Isn't that also after bleeding hearts? 
LMB, RMB after bleeding hearts. Yes, that's why they're kind of next to each other. Because that's also super armor and a knockdown. So you're potential second CC. I would say. <clears throat> okay. So, let's see, Mangler then. What are you waiting for? What do we put on Mangler though? Bam bam. Hmm. This comes after we already put a big DP debuff on them, right? Right. Hmm. Maybe lower their move speed, but uh, that's all like so slow, so low now. See, these are useless on that. <clears throat> Just go maybe with something defensive then? I think maybe, I'm not sure. Well, let's get some attack speed or cost speed on this maybe then. An extra human damage. In case I don't get the first CC off with this. With a grab. It means that Mangler will follow real fast. I think. Okay, what do I still have? Blood Moon Twist. Isn't that a skill? I have walk action. Yeah. Because I really didn't like this one a lot. <clears throat> Alright, what else do we have then? Many legends lie there. Hunting dead. Some have flow vice though. Let's go to flow vice and maybe just increase the down, uh, down smash chance on this as well. Should be... Should be uh, uh, <coughs> should be there. And maybe critical hit rate up as well. So we have a bit more of this. And then maybe well I mean bridal could do some damage though. Well what about um there's still this one. No, taunting the that's our super armor. Attack speed, casting speed on hit. I mean, what if we just add more slow then? It's maybe not much, but just some off a bit more, I suppose. There we go. Okay, now let's get very cheap weapons. So I can at least see if I, my button, my fingers still remember some of these buttons. Um, main weapon. Crescent Pendulum. Yuria. Doesn't need anything, power wise. Sub weapon, Noble Sword, right? Whichever one we can get. And then awakening. <clears throat> what are they called again? Rims and Glaives. How about this one here? Okay. Alrighty. Okay, so there's no cooldown on that. There's a cooldown on that one. Alright. I think that one's so slow though. And there's no real way to cancel that one, so I'm really not sure about that though. Okay, so anyway. 9 to 11 and 10 to 14. 9 to 11. 
10, 10 to 14. And now we have the proper skins. Uh, flow of twice. What's the cooldown on flow of ice? 12 seconds. Well, tail spins at 7. Okay, okay. Bum, bum, bum. What's. Uh... Wait, what's. What is. What do I have there? 12. What the frick is 12? How do we do pendulum again? Go back herself. Let's shift Q. Also a down smash. Let's try. This is probably gonna go really bad, but we can. Oh yeah, this one, Shift Q. That's actually a float as well, if you're lucky. Um, ba -da -ba 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 -ba. Not play this in ages, so this could go really, really wrong, honestly. This could definitely go really, really wrong, honestly. that are 100% was pretty decent though this one does pack a fair punch I think bum, 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 bum. still think that skill is just bad though Bartley pain backwards on B Uh, 
Oh boy. And I'm really low on bread. So my stamina is gonna kill me here, I feel. I feel like my stamina is gonna kill me here. Do a backward swan though. With v. We're hella squishy though. Is the grab not E? The grab is E, right? Is it not? I'll try to press E. I can't check now, I'm dead. Watch not. Let's see. Oh, my team's not winning it. My team's not winning it. It's gonna be really close here. Ah, unfortunate. Effort, though. Man, I wish I could check my skills now while I have some time. Watch out. <laughs> oh, nice grab there. <clears throat> ah, the moose in the back. normal. I'm really bad at the moment. So let's have a quick look here. On a one second. Invincible while moving. Super armor during cooldown. No collision while moving. It's the most definitely that. It's most definitely, yeah. Maybe I can use it.
Oh. Wait, we haven't gotten a single kill yet. That's the problem. Oh, crap. Unlucky. The Musa is just dashing all over the place and getting his HP back, huh? A little unfortunate there. Holy crap. Since that's a very short one, actually. Probably not gonna make this. Joking, right? What oh, a grab! Freak, I forgot that class is a grab, man. Oh man, I keep forgetting that it has a grab. You don't see many spell casters with a grab. I keep forgetting that. That's hell of unfortunate. Nice, so played though. My team got this. Dash, bloody stride, heals, alright? Hey, which else? Backwards on MB. What else? I need heals. Uh, flow mangler. That's not good. I think I'll be fine now. Okay, maybe not. Alright, hell no, the Musa does damage. 
Musa does freaking damage and he's already here, right? That's so stupid with Musa, man. So stupid with Musa, man. Oh, man. Oh, unbelievable. God damn it. The Musa just got me down so much more than I anticipated. Holy crap. Lan is squishy. I completely didn't remember that. Lan is so squishy. Holy frick, yo. Mm-hmm. Unfortunate. Dude, any of these heal a little bit? Uh, oh, this one a little bit. But that's a very short super armor, though. I got one, but one of us died as well. Ah, unlucky, unlucky. And GG. Sorry, though. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> This is probably gonna be very low damage, but let's have a look anyway. Let me switch the music, but I mean, well, so. See. <laughs> probably be pretty bad. 33k. Yeah, that's not so good. Let's try again, though. Q after all Q to all after the skills to. Oh, yeah, that's your, that's your combo near the end to go instantly into another down smash. Go from this to blow, and then that one. That's all for Regardo. So gotta be mindful for that. That's a new look in reward. Uh, I don't have a value pack running. I'm just gonna let it be there for now. To use twice. Yeah, okay. Yeah. 
Mm-hmm, mm hmm mm hmm mm hmm Stuck. Oh, no way. Wait, is that the same freaking dude from before? I think so. They just both of them keep chasing me here. There's nothing I can do with both of them chasing me down. Let's see, maybe they can. Bonk. Nova. Just walking around and grabbing everyone. <laughs> Teammates are running at them. Mm-hmm. 
Nice. Well, how's my graceful move? Huh? Mm-hmm. Oh, that's a frontal. Okay, I need to use that then. In my escape attempts. I can't see. I can't see. I can't see. Man. A lot unfortunate. I'm dead. Damn it. Fortunate. Man, the moment I take some damage, it's over with me in this one. Wait, are they both in Awakening? They are. I thought one of them was in a succession. Nice! They actually got the another one. Mm -hmm.
I think I can do a good sultry alive in front of my face, though. Definitely not with his claws. <laughs> I'm not good enough with that. Go in, go in. Take a lot of damage. Yabit. Take a whole lot of damage. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Nice. Nice CD. Probably be it. Somewhat to be expected with me here on the lawn, not being useful. Nope, nope, nope. I tried top. <laughs> Let's have a bit of a more look with some info next to me on the other monitor regarding the Guardian. Skills to lock and what skills she mainly uses and stuff like that. So a quick look at my damage. It won't be much, I think, though. 32k. I'm actually doing still a fair amount of damage though. In general. But struggling big as well. Let's have a look see. Because there's already a couple skills to lock. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Let's see, pre-awakening skills to lock. Merciless kick, apparently. Strike down. Beast demolisher. Not smite. Beast demolisher. And then juggernaut. Obviously, evasion. Mm 
And then there's a couple that you don't want to lock, but one is a lock apparently. Firebone rupture. But you still wanna put this on your hub bar though. According to what they say. And then God Incinerator and Cleansing Flame. Can probably be used from um from pre-awake. By using the hot bar. Oh, there we go. Is there a flow on this? Dragon's mouth shift on MV. Uh-huh. Let's see, so you do a grib. One LMB hit. What's this? Some big explosion looking like thing. What the frick is this? It's a pre awakened skill. Huh. Let's see. I'm not seeing this even. Oh, this skill changed. Yeah, this skill changed. I'm taking care of you, well, because I have nothing else. Searing Fang. So what what what's this? It's the grab into shift R and B two hits apparently. You only have protection on the first hit, so it's kind of risky. Going into a backwards L M B and then the. Uh, Already does not seem to work. Isn't it shift RMB? Shift LMB, my bad. Can't avoid Moy, are you joking?
That seems to do a bit of damage, huh? Is there no second CC? RMB after searing fine. Searing fine. Why don't we just hold that actually then? Is that a safer pick? Oh, rip, yo. Can't use it without it, huh? I think I know, I know what I'm doing wrong here as well. Well, I'm doing many things wrong, of course, but... Do we have backwards RMB is a float? Colonel steps RMB stun backwards F, but it's kind of your escape currently because that's just like an iframe on command or RMB super armor invincible wall concealed holding on slash attacks. Do have this glow to ashes, cleansing flame, frost slide. That's pretty weak stuff, I think. Yeah. No, oh, no, wait. We don't have this one here. Okay. Super armor. Super armor after searing. There's a long cooldown actually on that grab though. Side. Freaking cool, though. Let me have a quick look here at what some things stay. That's a freaking 20 AP buff. Okay, I see. Log this, use from hotbar only. Use for pre-buffing for 20 AP. Okay. Dragon Maw hits like a truck. <laughs> and the flow as well. Oh, pretty cool. Cleansing flame as your bond. Okay, indeed. Huge AoE protected flow with solid damage.
God Incinerator is the you know skill that makes everything look. Oh, recommend Hotbar this as well. But uh, it's unprotected though. Follow up CC. Forward RMB. Cleansing Flame is unavailable. So forward RMB is actually used kind of. Okay, Scornful Slash. No, wait, what? SRMB, stupid. Loading on hits. This is a bomb though. This one. So this might mess you up a bit. Okay. SLMB. Still super funny though. I don't have a guardian, so I'll have to. I'd have to level it up. Um, well, let's go to battle arena with this already. Let's put some skills on the hotbar. So let's see. So we have neck. It's gonna be on one. Then we have cleansing flame. It's gonna be on two. This is the. Um, do we not have a backwards LMB? Oh, yeah, this one. Um. Yeah, let's just do glory. On three. And then scorn. On four. With searing fang on five, um, and the flow has no cooldown, so there's no need for that. Hmm. Then I think God on six, it's then Dragon Maw and it's flown uh, seven. 
Bring it on Simon. Um. Hmm. Let's buy a wind on eight. Then I have my mobility skills are 11, 14, 15, and 16. So 11, 14, so Jugger will be on 14, and 11 is our frost light. That's on 11, 15 could be Wind on 15 then. Oh wait, it's already on there. It's the other one. It's uh, Nemesis. Or Infernal Nemesis on 15. I haven't looked at rebound skill yet at all. I can sprint like this. Oh, that's badass. What's the 100 actually? In front of the Nemesis. Ooh. Super armor knockdown on hits, huh? <laughs> that looks interesting for sure. Alright, let's keep let's see what we have here actually. A forward guard with nothing, a super armor. I honestly think super armor is probably a better one. You have maybe? Let's see. Well, that's a sl but both of them are unprotected as a hag. Flies flame of calling, all speed reduction debuff on hits. Guess the X maybe. And then Yeah, I would say this maybe Mountain's Echo? Super armor during the skill. <laughs> That's the backwards RMB is your float on the heads, right? Yes. my stuff me in. What was this one again? That one. Should honestly be more on the movement skills, huh? 16. Let's put that on 16. From 8 to 16, yo. Aye. I'm like looking at you all the time and you ain't do nothing. 
You ain't doing nothing for me. Okay? Okay. Also, honestly, she's about rotating these, down, I think. Just kind of keep rotating, st rotating stuff, I would say, almost. Hiccup. Why oh, she's protected during her kick? Are you joking? Oh, it's only a down smash, okay. Backward telling me super armor on lost attack hits. And it's long animation. Shift LMB. Torso Ripper, huh? A hell, Torso Ripper. Beast Demolisher. We logged that, but I know. Mutilation. <laughs> Super armor. Backwards F. some damage. Yeah. <laughs> I can do that from free away. Okay, that's kinda cool. Does this actually CC or not? I don't think so, right? No, it's just down attack, recover HP per hit, invincible while moving and super armor attacks. I don't need to attack instantly.
go pretty far though. It's kind of funny, not gonna lie. <laughs> I don't know what to do with this thing. the crew is like I don't know love the winter tattoos that she's going on there all the time though where's the one she got came out with oh yeah the one she came out with was this one but it's like uh, purely for this I got Let's go play some Busa. At least that I know normally how to play. Or I should at least. Why not? A little bit, I think. I hope. <laughs> Yabe. Let's give it a go. At least. I'll go to check the selection just to be safe that it works. I'm still standing here, I forgot. Totally forgot that we're still standing here on this character. Mm. Let's go to the bosses. And there were a couple on, right? Yeah. At least this I know somewhat how to play properly. From what I do say. 
Awakening with a weaponized charm is bound into a tome and can have a brooch that writes the name of the deceased and harness the power of the second flower guard. A field blooming in the netherworld. Boots awakening with the power of his netherworld summons the souls of the deceased from the tomb using the calligraphy brush to attack. Also, Wusa can summon flowers of death to strategically block enemies. Mid to mini. While we're running there, let's have a look at how some of these look. So, Lunar Serrate. It's our e buff. Uh, HP recovery plus 1 of 30 seconds and allies upon using the skill. Oh, and mana regeneration as well. Let's just have a look. Bit of a buff. Oh, yeah, okay, that's kind of cute. Oh, we have Purging Flames. Okay, Soul Dance is a normal attack. Soul Cleanses are RMB. Alright. Sorry, Flowers. Hmm. Waltz. Super Armor during the skill. Movement speed minus 20 on the hits. Why did we see that twice? Oh, you can use it twice maybe, I guess then. Okay. Let's see, backwards E is a forward guard during the skill. All AP is stiffened before attacks, floating on the attacks. There's a flow which is floating on hits forward guard before the attack hits as well. Chip, 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 chip. And there's the flow. An extra wave. Okay, extra big wave. Backwards LMB is a stiffness on attack and knockdown on attacks too. Nether Strike, super army during the skill with just damage. Someone to get closer on them, apparently. Then. Super army during the skill with stun on attacks, PvE only. Super army during the skill, hold E after the shower. Let's take a look at Soul Shower on itself first. And then Soul Shock afterwards. Okay. Forward guard and a bond, but PvE only shift on MB. Her skills look nice though with this as well, I'm not gonna lie. Then we have forward guard shift E, followed up by another forward guard with just damage. Yep. <laughs> Alright. Here we have Bloom Burst is backwards RMB, has a flow. Boom. Okay. This is actually a stun on hits, by the way, my mistake. We have Bloom Deluge, forward RMP, it's a knockdown, but unprotected. We have a shift RMP called Life Lure, forward guard, with just damage. Sorry, Flower will knock down on hits, so there is a flow. Second field. Damage. We have Shift F Moonlit Blast. Being a down smash, down on his, but PvE only super armor during the skill. And we have a couple cores. I think I like Succession more. I'm not sure. I mean, the rain skills and the butterflies look hella nice in, in, on her, I think. What's still glowing under? I always confused. What's still glowing? Bunch, <laughs> bunch, bunch. Hello, Rian Metro is welcome, welcome. 
Let's boost up PvE overall. I've honestly not done a lot of PvE in general. Um, all I've done on her since I kind of recently started playing her is Elvia Red Orcs. It goes pretty smooth in there, but I think Orc Camp is probably a little hard to discuss about, right? Because you have to debuff the enemies, you have your buff going as well every 20 minutes if you're lucky for 10 minutes, one-shotting everything. As far as I've seen videos and somewhat guides and tier lists, I think Succession Wusa usually is a little better PvE-wise than Land Succession. I'm not 100% sure though, you might have to look up some guides. The ones I've been looking at lately, let me take a look. Because there's also someone making apparently continuously really bad tier lists out there. So you don't happen to look at one of his videos. Let me see if I can still find something. I think it's called Blue Squadron. Pretty sure his info is fairly decent. Mm. Might have deleted the VOD though. In my history, I'm taking a look. How are you doing by the way? How's your day going? Yeah, I might have deleted the VOD. Uh, Kite Games is apparently the one you don't want to watch. Let's see, if I just type it in. <laughs> yeah, Blue Squadron, I'm pretty sure his info is pretty good. And he actually made a PvE tier list. Um, and also, keeping in mind the different, uh, you know, places slash tiers are you like. Low end grinding, mid end grinding, or high end uh, PvE grinding. He made the difference between all of those. I mean, a lot will depend a little bit on your gear as well, of course. You probably have higher than me since I haven't played super long in a long time. I don't play with PvE add-ons though. Because I'm more of a PvPer. I've also never really tried Succession LAN, honestly. Uh, the LAN gameplay before was me trying her out in Awakening again a little bit in case it would still work for me, yes or no. But I was doing horrible, so yeah, there's that. <laughs> oh, I haven't, uh, I haven't taken a proper look at Succession Lawn. I should probably, because as far as I saw, that's a little bit better in like more group content, I guess. More decent in one vx, because you kind of jump in and jump out again. I've been looking at. Testing out multiple classes a little bit it's to find something to tag together with the whiz. <laughs> I don't know. I still don't know, honestly. Still haven't figured it out yet which one I'll take. Eventually. I took a long video break, so I mean, at the end of the day. My info is probably not the best. Just being honest here.
I mean, as far as I know, Succession Witch is actually your uh, your Giga top tier EV ear. And Nova, obviously. Awakening Nova. Awakening Nova, PvE, can't go wrong with that. No matter the spot. In case if you'd actually be looking for, you know, your highest PvE performer. Though Awakening Nova does have a high APM. Actions per minute. You'll be a busy bee if you play that. But I mean, that's one of the things that makes it fun, right? Having to press a lot of buttons all the time. PvE, I think. Uh, I think Succession's still better, isn't it? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Let me see. Let me have a look. I haven't played the Awakening yet, to be honest. Let me have a quick look what the Discord says. If it says anything, <laughs> it doesn't. No, it doesn't say anything. Well, there's people, most people that I see on the Discord say that Succession is better for PvE.
some junk, man. I can actually get rid of this one. Will not be using that. Too far already to start using that crap. Lucky didn't get the big one. Alright, let's see if we get lucky here. Probably not though. Alright, Layton's not too bad. Layton's worth some money. A lot less than it used to be, but still. It's worth something. And uh Orkana was actually a pry. Okay. Okay, Seraph's bad. And Centaur is bad. up at least now as well. Dice reminder. Noah. Get it. <laughs> okay, now that we're here, let's do a little bit of arena. Just put it on there for now. Like 
了。了解。Sork Valk against Draconia Scholar and Archer. The Draconia might be a bit of a problem though. Back, I didn't see. I think I'm fine though. Again, I think we're good still. Color is just, you know. Scholar be scholar, I guess. Her Majesty's orders are absolute, and I'm just following them. <clears throat> I do need to try and add that a lot more often.
these VLs real quickly? Damn, that's my mistake there. They have a little bit more HP. Yo, can you stop freaking tryharding, you stupid idiot, man. I don't like it. <clears throat> Let's try to get that archer. Honestly, I think that's the win. Yeah, we need to get to the archer. The archer is indeed a problem here. I'm not even joking.
That's unfortunate. Oh, the rock. This might mm, be my dad here. Got a couple kills at the end. I'm not sure if I'll um, be MVP because some other teammates got more, I think. But I do feel like my damage will be definitely there. Dun, dun, dun. Hey, 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 MVP. Definitely felt like my damage should have been there. Three K damage, yo. Let's go. Udra Kanya was apparently not able to do anything, yo. That's definitely good. Uh, yeah, we can bring them to any anyone. Uh, Daishan, right? Oh, uh, Wandering Alchemist. Die. Daishan? No? Wait, what? What's his name? Oh, Dali Shane. My bad. Dali. <laughs> if I'm making time for I have no time for small talk. There's barely time for potion research.
What does oh, this do? Oh, hi. Wow. If I'm making time for you, that's because I believe I can learn something Press from you. Press RB to obtain lights on a fire according to set probability. Ah, okay. Okay, like that. Okay. I have no time for small talk. There's barely time for potion research. I... Hey. Hey. Ba -ba -ba -da -da. Master of Swords and Dole Arts. Against another Wusa. The Valkyrie. Okay. See how it goes, I guess. You see Wusas fairly often, though. Bum, 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 bum. Wow, she does indeed run in fast, huh? Me quickly be out. Be dead here, honestly. Yep. <laughs> that Valk was really fast indeed. she do there? She caught me by surprise as well. I didn't know she was gonna be that fast. That's kind of messed up. I get CC there. I got grabbed. 
That was just grab. Find me again, yo. Yeah, okay, that Corsair is just all over the freaking place, man. Oh, on the side again. What the hell? The damage is well done. Holy crap. I think I can do there. But I'm getting just continuously hit in my back door. Unbelievable. I'm just literally always in front of a guard getting CC. All the time. Just all the time. I do one tiny frontal guard and I'm just getting CC'd in the back instantly. Holy crap. Good right. GG. Yeah, that was messed up though. Every tiny baby frontal guard that I do. As short as it possibly could be, I am getting seat. Hmm. Hugely unfortunate. Yeah, just a one little frontal frontal guard stun or float or knockdown, whatever it is. And I'm just hit in the back instantly by something that CCs me and then the rest messes me up. A little unfortunate. Twenty nine K damage. Not too bad I guess compared to the fact that we just couldn't do anything. You just got freaking honestly she just got carried by the damn CC from that dude. Holy crap. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, okay. Talking to your black spirit. Pathetic. Hmm.
Is that what I like? Isn't that like almost the same as what I'm using? And I'm using corrupted still. They're using max HP and all AP up and extra damage to humans. So, to put the damage up, all AP plus two. I mean, I think that's also fine. Other than that, I think we almost have the same stuff going. That Corsair, though. Holy crap. Stormfall all DP up. I mean, you do use this basically of cool, and I'm not gonna lie. And that DP buff lasts for a very long time. I have it on the swirl. Attacking cost speed going up though all the time. To make sure he can keep casting fast. I mean that does make sense as well, I'm not gonna lie. An extra damage to humans on things that you do near the end, I guess. take a look at those later this is the skill that heals as well right instantly cover 35 hp per target hit i mean one-on-one -on -one it's not gonna do much obviously but that is the the self heal already recover 400 hp per hit i mean whatever extra hp is extra hp it's simple as that But I feel like all the CCs that hit me coming from the freaking uh, Corsair were the problem. Those felt like the biggest issue. Ah, for me, Thunderstroke also has the increased attack and cost speed. Ah, uh -huh. true, true. What does it say? Which ones give me that, actually? I mean, Stormfall gives it for 10... for 20 seconds, though. Stormfall gives me that for 20 seconds, though. And its cooldown is 15. So, I should basically have that up almost all the time as well. Mm -hmm. I mean, that extra DP is a pretty good idea, though. I also use it, but a different one. Because you are a pretty, you know, long costing class, so the extra defense power keeps you alive a lot. Problem being that I have it on this skill. Huh? Which I sometimes forget to use. I tend to use it combined with the heal, of course, to then get the DP. But with this, I mean, it would be up a lot all the time. Okay, uh, which way do we go? Oh, this way. Let's see. I mean, that Wisa was level 64, so it has a l more experience on it than me. Bam, bam, bam. Right. 
it's different to you. Two sorbs. Yikes. Kind of fuck. Valkyrie grab. And a Valkyrie grab again. And I couldn't really cancel it in time. Right? Okay, he got me in the front one. Should be fine now. I'm gonna wait with the V, I think. Okay, now I might be in trouble, I'm not sure. Nah, I'm still good. What the hell? Ha! 
the full crazy again on me. Valkyrie keeps going for me. <laughs> Insane. So far, so good. Hmm. I've never tried Sage, though. Sage has like those big teleports though, that makes him so annoying. Oh, it's so tired. No way she gets this. Sage, okay. Sage got MVP. Oh, my feet hurt. <laughs> or my my ankles more, I guess. Damaged me. Nice. 
And he also got a couple more kills. But well, I'll take the 63k damage though, not too bad. Hmm. Alright, I'm gonna call it here for today. Thank you for joining though. Enjoy the rest of your day, evening or night, and hope to see you next one. Thank you again, bye bye. Yeah. Thank <laughs> you.